Just uh, giving people a bit of info about our religion, answering any questions that people might have. We ourselves are Muslims, we believe in Islam. Do you guys follow a faith at all? Islam is to believe that there is one creator and sustainer of all existence, one creator of the universe, who we call Allah, and we should live our lives according to the will of Allah. Islam is to believe in one creator, Allah, and to live one's life according to the will of the creator and sustainer of all existence, Allah. And if a person does that sincerely, you'll be successful in the life to come. That's what Islam is. Islam is the path to success in the life after death. And all the other paths that deviate from Islam uh, lead to, uh, to, uh, to ruin, to, to trouble in the afterlife, to suffering in the afterlife. Do you believe in God? Yeah. Not really, like. Guys, I'd love to give you one of these each, if that's all right. Please don't use them for roach material. That's the only, uh, <laughs> the, the only uh, request I have. Well, have a read of them when you get the chance, guys, all right? Imagine if you said to me, Dan, my name's Dan. Uh, who made these booklets? And I said, no one made them. There was just some paper, some ink, and over a million years, they turned themselves into a booklet. W would you believe that? No. We, we wouldn't believe even a booklet like that could happen by accident. So surely this universe didn't happen by accident. When we look at a booklet, we know it's got an author, it's got a printer. And when we look at this universe, we know deep down it has a creator. And this creator we as Muslims call Allah. And Islam is to live your life according to the will of Allah and to reap the rewards as a result in the life to come. So if you want to be successful after death, Alam, get on, uh, take Islam as your path. I, I did 20 years ago, Kim did five years ago. It's the best decision we've ever made. And we would like you to, to uh, join the path and uh, journey to the afterlife with us, uh, Alam. But um, what I've just said, what, what is that? Uh, have you got any response or reaction to that? Well, I'm just not a religious guy, you know, like, you know what I mean? Okay, okay. I said, what, when, when you were walking past, I said these two lads might stop and talk. They look like hip hop guys. I thought you might be a like rap music uh, enthusiast. Am, am I right? I thought so. I thought so. So, guys, have a read of them, please. And um, if you have any questions or anything, our email address is on the back. Thank you so much, guys. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you. You too, mate. You too. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Thank you, mate. Thanks. Thank you very much. God bless you, mate. Take care. Please do, mate. Please do. Thanks. Cheers, guys. Thanks for stopping by. Dear. I've experienced um, people just want to get a bit of information and then be on their way. And sometimes you've just got to accept that. Give them a bit of info, sow some intellectual seeds and let them go and let them seeds grow, inshallah. Let them go and then make dua and who knows what can happen. It's not always about jihadists. Sometimes it's about giving some info and giving people literature and letting Allah do the rest, inshallah.